What's going on everybody? This is episode 5 of building the city under fire map and um, unfortunately I was doing the original episode 5 and I didn't record the audio so uh, basically what that was was blocking off the outskirts of the map so you know creating the barriers that lead outside the map these were already here um, let's see where did I where did I go I started working on this side over here so I added the sandbags and some crates and a couple of fencing and uh, box crates and then uh, added some pile here with uh, the concrete walls and a broken helicopter went over to or let's go back into the tunnel where's the tunnel okay so here's the tunnel and uh, that we come down from so here's the uh, here's the tunnel so I just added a pile there I'll go into detail add some you know maybe some pipes laying around later and then of course this little uh, metal door metal door here and uh, already added that added a little fence area here blocked off the entire inside part of the building of course left the windows there and so on and so forth I'm, I'm gonna be doing the windows now probably but um yeah all the way up until we get to the roof to the extraction zone so uh in this video i'm gonna go ahead and finish this building and i'm gonna start adding some windows to it and uh i'm gonna go ahead and select the bar that i got here that way it all matches we'll go ahead and uh raise it up drop it and then duplicate it duplicate it duplicate it once again um select both or all of these and i'll just line it up to the corner here make sure that's good uh, a little bit further over wouldn't hurt there we go and then maybe add one more for this side uh, that's a little funky so let's try to even these out just a little bit try to make a nice little even and eh, it's fine I'll leave it all right so I'm gonna do the same thing on the other on the other side Make sure it's good. There we go. Um, what else? Let's add. Um, I don't know how tall the 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 windows are. Glass. Let's type in glass. Um. Oh, what is this? Oh, okay. That's like a corner piece window. I need a large one. Ooh. Mm, this might... That might work. It's hard to tell, because... Of course, I can flip it. Ooh. Ooh, this one's longer, too. See, I like that. I just need one that's... That wide, but taller. Okay. Let me go back and resize. Turn on our snap, uh, snap rotation. I'll go ahead and put the first one. Ah, uh, a little bit too large of a window. So what we'll do is we'll just kind of even them all out. Um. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. There we go. And there we go. Um, yeah, that's, that should be okay. And then what I'll do, I'll just go ahead and delete these. And just start working on this side, since I've got this side a little bit more developed than the other side. Mm 
get rid of that flickering. Okay, get rid of the flickering once again. Okay, I'm gonna grab these uh, and then grab the um, the glass, raise it up, raise it up again, and raise it up. Nah, that's, that, that's fine. I'm, like I said, I'm not being too picky with this map. Okay, that is a roof. Ceiling, I mean. There you go. Go to select. Just going to select all these. Select that one, select that one, and then just duplicate it directly over. So I don't know if I've mentioned, I'm actually building my first PvP styled um, map in the game. I really hate that vehicles do not have the same object preference when it comes to um, respawning, I like time respawn, because the weapons you can set a time to when the weapon will uh, respawn on your map, that really needs to be a thing for um, vehicles too, because cause I was thinking about it and I was like, well, players will get into vehicles and they'll drive around. Of course, the vehicles be, will be blown up. And um, I could definitely see, I mean, after, let's say, after a few minutes, depending on, you know, how many vehicles are blown up, eventually the map's just going to be ground combat only, which, I mean, it will be ground combat only, but it'll only be just boots on the ground. There won't be any more vehicles or airplanes or helicopters because they didn't respond. So hopefully uh, in the near future we get an update to um, the editor where we can select a time of when vehicles uh, will respond. Okay, so we got the window area secured. Of course, it's probably gonna look weird for some windows, like this one here is sticking out. Um, I'll just put it in the middle there. Oh, well. Okay. So obviously, um, we've got, you know, we want to make sure that building looks authentic. So don't want anybody to come over here and see the, you know, unfinished building, of course. But I'll go ahead and work on the, like, outside of the map look later. So I think what we'll do now, since I've already done just the basic outline of the map and covering off the outskirts of the map. Ooh, I gotta cover off this cover off uh cover this alleyway. Um what do I want to type in? Fence. Of course uh you don't want to use a movable object when doing when you're trying to block a player off because then they'll just of course Either blow it up and move it, or um, just push it out of the way. So, well, let's go ahead and run back to the start. I did some detail work um, on the start of the map. Of course, it needs a little bit of more. I'm going to get rid of uh, this because it's sticking out of the pipe and it looks weird. So, um... What I'll do is go into a little bit more detail with the map all the way through. And then, of course, depending on how far I'm in, I'll go ahead and add just a tiny bit more detail. You know, you, you want to have like a s second, like, coat, you know, second like a second coat of paint. And uh, just over your map. 
So, uh, let's see, what, what can we add here? I think just the basic details are kind of fine. Um, like this area is pretty basic, pretty fine. Well, let's start in the kitchen. So, uh, we'll type in a uh, kitchen. See what we can get for kitchen. So, maybe we'll get, here we go, metal metal counter. That is a... Uh, Definitely a must. You would definitely see something like that in the kitchen, the restaurant. Uh, we set that there. I wonder if there's ooh pots and pans. Yeah. Um, how did? Wait. I gotta see how this come goes up. I can't tell which one, which way is the front. Oh, okay. So I see. Bam. Bam. Alrighty. And, uh, I wonder if there's some ovens. Type in oven. Got an easy bake oven. Kitchen oven. Oh, man. That would have been perfect. But it has, like, that, that house cabinet up top. Oh, here we go. Oven griddle. Uh, no. Hey, look, it's the Far Cry 4 oven. And I wonder if there's a microwave. Micro. Hey, there's a microwave. Cool. For when the uh, customers complain their food's cold, and you can just put the food in and do another one. Oh, got a, what is this? Microphone stand, research table, that wouldn't be in a kitchen. All right, let's type in fridge. Let's see what we got under fridge. Beer fridge. Actually, this can go right here. Beer fridge. Uh, fridge large. Perfect. Hopefully, Gordon Ramsay won't see this. Um. What else can we type in? A uh, table, I guess. Ta table. Um, no. Bar table, no. I need like a kitchen table. Just a place to put things. Ooh. No, we already have a sink. Nah, let's put another one. This place is pretty busy until the war started. Now it's just a war zone. I'm typing metal. That's probably not the wisest decision, but there's a lot of metal stuff. Oh, what is this? Cabinet metal. Ah, oh, here we go. That looks pretty nice. Beep. And, um... Some of this stuff... Ah, oh, yeah, you know what? Let me just replace some of this stuff, because it saves us, saves us some time. We can throw objects, um that are already pre-designed. And I I'm actually glad they have a wide range of different objects. Like they're the same object, they just have more objects on the object. Because for beginner map editors who don't really care about going into detail, they don't actually have to. You know, the, the, the game is already like that for them. And uh, and it makes it makes making a map a little bit quicker too, but it also makes it look a little bit more nicer and not so basic, like this sink. So we can type in food and we can get a different type. Which of course, if you're on the console, you can't type anything in. Unfortunately, it'd be nice if they would put something like that for console players. Um, what is this? Dried food. I don't know, but we'll add it. Bucket of food. Packs. Eh. I'm just throwing things down. Can add some of that there. Let's type in plates. Plates. There should be some plates. Mini fridge cup. Oh, nice. I don't know why, I actually don't know what's in this room. 
That's the manager's office. We'll just say that. He's keeping an eye on the food. So, whoops. Nope. Here we go. Got, got some nice little uh, plates here. Some toast. Okay. And uh, what else? What else can we put down? Let's type in can. Maybe we get a some spaghettios. All right. Nope. Cans food. Oh, uh, we got. Oh, that's a paint can. I don't want to add a paint can in here. No, already got that object up. I don't normally like to put the same object down, especially in the same place, but. Ooh, trash can. Yeah, just put that there. Um, should be a smaller trash can, too. Hopefully, they have a little smaller one, like a desk size garbage can. No, I was going to put one down by something. Um, all right, this, like I said, this is the manager's office. Desk, we'll type in desk, put the manager's desk in here. Um, there we go. That's uh, the manager wouldn't have a radio. Nope. Nope. Oh, here we go. Yeah. This one has a mic. He yells at the people to get back to work. There we go. And then, uh, of course, we can add some file cabinets, maybe. We'll type in file, get a series of uh, file cabinets. Maybe. Oh, no, I didn't even type it in. Oh, wow, there's actually not that much. This is the uh, Far Cry 4 file cabinet. Okay. Let's type in, uh, just type in cab, cab, cab. See what we get under this. Cab and metal. No. That'd be too much. Oh, hey, the mini, little mini garbage can. That was a little clock. Okay. I do like that. Oh, here we go. File cabinet. We don't want ammo. And a coffee maker. That's that's what we need. A little coffee maker. Even got a coffee mug there. Perfect. And uh, let's see what else. What is this? Oh, no. Don't want that. Tool cabinet, not needed. No, okay. Um, what else can we do? Can we add a puddle? Like a small little puddle? Maybe somebody spilled some orange juice. What is this? Put no, oh, it's like a mud puddle. A, a blood puddle. Um, you know, maybe we could do something with that. I don't know. I'll worry about that later. Maybe, maybe there's somebody who died in here during the war or the fight or the battle. So we go out to here and of course we have the basic, you know, uh, dining area and I'll, I'll go ahead and type in beer. And beer bottles lying on the floor. Oh, here we go. This is pretty, there's already one over here. Well, let's add another one. Maybe some kegs. Um, what can we do? Let's have the kegs back here. That, I think would make a little bit more sense. Okay, and then, um... I'm not a bartender, so I don't know how... Everything is set up, but... I'll do my best. Maybe some beer crates. Eh, right there, maybe. Ooh, we can put this sign up. It says beer. Of course, it would be facing both directions. Oh, and I don't even think I can do that. 
No, because then this part sticks out. I can't do that. Um, oh, here's a... Let's just do it here. Beer. I didn't see any shelves, though, for beer. Let's type in shelf or shell. That way we have a more wider range of um, shelves. Beer. Shel Ooh. Can I... We're back in the kitchen area now. Nah, I don't care. Let's just put it right here. It's okay. Now I gotta type in shelf again. Research table, no. No. Ooh, boots. What is this? No. Beer. Beer. Oh. Oh, no, that's a... You know what? We'll add that. Nah, we'll not add that. Because I'm thinking this restaurant's kind of... I don't know. I think this restaurant's more of a cigar place than cigarettes. I want to put a carpet down, though. Where's the, uh... I must have... Maybe I passed it. They have to have a shelf full of beer. Or alcohol. Or something. No, not a store shelf. Let's type in ALK. No. Huh. Okay. Um, bottle. I think I had actually typed... There it is. Yeah, so there's a good collection of... Um, little different bottles here. Why? Oh, here we go. You know what? Maybe there's a wine shelf. So we'll type in wine. There's not. Um... We'll type in shelf again. I guess I'm gonna have to do it manually. So we'll type in shelf and let's choose a let's choose a decent looking shelf. I don't even know why I'm said I wasn't gonna be too picky with this map, but uh I don't care there. Let's just put it put it down. Duplicate it. Um well, I want the player to be able to come back here if he needs to. Okay, let's type in, uh, whoops, type in bottle again, and so what I'm going to do is just turn on, um, add multiple objects, and then I could just flip it and turn it and keep adding it down. I don't have to keep going back and forth, clicking. And of course we can add the wine bottles here and there. Um, just something random every now and then. Whoops, that's too tall. That's too tall. Eh, put that there. No. Wine. Wine. And then, what else can we do? Let's do, um, uh, beer again, because there was the beer crate. Beer fridge, yeah, we already added that. Is that beer pong? It is. Okay, um... Dang. Yeah, here it is. Beer crate. That's what I wanted. Just had that down there. Okay. Let's type in carpet. Just to give this place a little bit of fancy. We have the Far Cry 4 carpet. That's actually pretty close to what I was thinking. Ooh. I do like that. Oh, I don't know why I exited that out. Let's type in straw. I didn't mean to do the caps. Far Cry 4 had um, a straw mat. What is this? Oh. Oh, hey, that's pretty cool. You know what? You could probably build a, a custom airplane out of this. 
I don't know why the image isn't loading though. No, they don't have a... Let's type in rug. Rug stripes. No. Uh, yeah. Let's do that. Okay. And then, um, we have some TVs already in here. And that's, that's pretty basic. And we'll go back into detail again. We'll do that second, um, second, uh, coat, coating. All right, so... Now we'll add some a uh, little bit of detail, basic basic detail to this area, and we'll type in uh, wrecked, and we'll just put a wrecked car down somewhere just to have for maybe some cover and put it there. That's fine. And then um, I'm actually thinking about some sandbags right here. Uh, so we'll do the small sandbags. I didn't mean to do that. I got to turn off. Add multiple objects. I'm going to lower that down. And then just spin it around. Whoops. And then... Whoops. Turn on center selection. I mean, it's obviously not even perfect, but like I said, I'm not picky about it right now. This is just the basic map. Okay. Let's add a lawnmower. I just had this pop up in my head. Lawn. There we go. You know what? Let's make this interesting. Hands hand oh man no that's not what I wanted I was gonna put like some hands on the handle part and they're hopefully they would have been cut off but um, yeah that that didn't work out okay so we have some grass let's type in bushes let's see what we got I hadn't actually fooled around with a lot of the um, nature objects bush there we go so I'm not sure at, at all the different types of bushes that, that are on this uh, list here. Well, that's pretty. Yeah, let's put it down. What about this? That's a little pretty. We'll put it in the corner here. Um, let's, uh, oh, that's it. Oh, let's type in pot. Maybe there's a flower pot. Ooh, I like, yeah, here we go. Oh, yeah, let's put these here. Perfect. Nope. Let's do... Then we got a flower pot. I like that. Um, what else can we do? Got another flower pot. Let's type in um, flower. Maybe we'll get a different selection of flowers. Flower pile, no. Flower cult, what's this? A little small flower, no. What's this? Yeah, I can add that there. That's fine. Let's type in sprinkler. There we go. Just a little bit of sprinkler. A couple sprinklers there. And uh, yeah, I, I think that's okay. I mean, I guess we could add, like, a collection of grass. Let me go to the collections. Add. Yeah, I'm actually not too, um... I haven't messed around with this a lot either. So, let's see what we got. Usually I like to put a small amount down just to see what I'm working with. And then, of course, you can go in and change it while it's placed down just to get an idea on what you've got. Oh, I like that little uh, gra uh, little yellow flower there. Let's see if we can get some more. Oh, yeah, there we go. Um, let's do add again. I do. I did like that first uh, grass though. And of course we can. Or let's see if we can put the yellow flower over here. 
Nope. Uh, we'll leave that one then. There we go. And you know what? Let's uh, let's just let's see what we can. Let's type in uh, let's type in chair. Actually, I should have typed in rocking chair because that's what I was thinking. A director's chair. Whoops, there it is. I wonder if there's a name on the back. Oh, director. Um, yeah, let's put a little folding chair there. No. There we go. Cool. All right, let's add some some more cover here. Cover is crucial, especially since there's turrets up there and probably RPGs. So, um, I'm thinking of we can do let's type in concrete conch. We can do something like this, and then just we can add something to it. So let's type in bag. Bag. There we go. And uh, what? Uh, where's that bag at? I know there's like a sandbag. Here it is. We can just add that there. And. Um, Just kind of layer that. That's fine. Of course, we're going to need the traffic light. I still got to put down um, the power lines, too, as well as um, the street lights. I haven't put any street lights down. I've only been only been putting down traffic lights. I done got that backwards. Whoops. It's supposed to go over here. I always hate it when I stop at a traffic light and the light is right above my car. I can't see it when it turns green. So, put those further back. And then, um, what else can we do? I mean, obviously it's a city. We need more cars. So we can type in wrecked. And of course I'll put like, uh, drivable cars. But those are only there for, like, explosive purposes only. I don't want to do the same car. We can do a truck. And then, um... We can do, uh... Let's, let's get a little bit more creative here. And just get rid of our center selection for one. Flip seat over. Bam. Okay. Turn it that way a little bit. There we go. Then we'll just drag the car over like that. Should be okay. Just to get a little bit more creative there. Instead of is that a corpse? Oh, that's not what I wanted. Corpse. Um, this guy. No, I need a guy that's laying on the ground. Yeah, he got he got hit. Okay. Um. What's this? Oh no. Let's type in wrecked again. Goodness, I keep uh, I don't keep uh. Or I keep not clicking on the search bar. What else? I hadn't decided how bad of a war zone this is. So adding like adding all these broken cars, you know, I'm, I'm not entirely a hundred percent sure on how bad it is. Because obviously, there's some buildings that you want to be broken, you know, but these buildings are like still in perfect condition. So maybe it maybe the fight just started. So we'll leave it there. Um, yeah, maybe maybe some dumpsters got pushed out for cover. Who knows, you know? Um, where's the nearby alleyway? I think the nearby alleyway is over here. So some dumpsters got pushed out just for some cover. Slant that a little bit. Because one side's on the curb. 
And what else? Car, yes. Let's type in cover. Let's see what we get just from typing in cover. A bed barricade. Oh, that's pretty cool. We could definitely add that somewhere. Maybe in the alleyway up ahead we'll add that. Ooh, a brick stack. Uh, no. Doesn't match the building there, so it doesn't... Uh, dang it, I'm being picky again. I'm not actually normally, normally picky like that, but... I like to at least kind of make the map a little bit more... Like, lively, I guess. But it doesn't matter. Oh, we're at rocks. I want to say there's, um, like a sheet of metal that. No. Mm. Can add this. Is this floating? It is. That's okay. I'll just lower it down. And we'll, do, we'll, we'll do another one. Then we'll just turn it different direction. And sand. Okay, and then uh, we'll just add this one right here. Type in barrel. Okay. Now we can get we can get a little bit more creative. They don't actually have the uh, the rubble or rubble um, texture anymore. I don't think. I was looking. I looked twice and I couldn't find it. They could have changed the picture. That's a riverbed. That's, um, yeah, I kind of, I do hate that a little bit because I use that quite a bit. Yeah, it's, it's gone. Oh, well. So we can make some, uh, humps things. Oh. I just actually thought it occurred to me. Let's add some craters. So we'll get lower that hardness down. That way it's a little bit more of a uh, slope, I guess. And uh, we can add maybe a crater right below the car. That way a player can get a little bit lower behind that car for cover if needed to. And to mark these, um, I'm going to go ahead and go to generic dirt. I'm going to turn up the speed, and I'm just going to put this in there, just to kind of mark it. Of course, you could add a little bit of black to indicate. i turn up the hardness. Oh, I can't go any smaller than that. Oh, dang, I was wanting to create like a, you know, that impact marker, but I guess I can't. Okay, whatever. Um, what else? What else? What else? You know what? Let's let's just go way out of the park here for no reason. And we'll make a trench. Do the same thing. Whoops. Let me select the dirt first. I don't know how deep that goes. It doesn't go that deep. And we'll type in wrecked again. Maybe some cars fell in here. No, I'll just put it over here. Okay. Now we can type in debris. Well, actually, I'm going to type in pipe first. Um... And we can choose like a small pipe selection. Pipe kit. 
another pipe kit. They have a longer pipe kit. They do. Here we go. Yeah, I don't think... Uh, I don't know. Maybe. Maybe this will work. Nope. No, that ain't gonna work. The ditch have to be, uh... The ditch would have to be lower. That's fine. I mean, you could just have that there for show if you wanted to, but... What we will do... Or what I'll do... Is, um... Type in something, I guess. Debris... Nope, it's not what I wanted. Um, no, no. Car wreck wrecked. No, maybe maybe there's a. I don't know. Maybe there's a truck down in here. Okay, that's fine. I'll leave that. And then, of course, um, sand. We'll just add this right here, and then add this right there. And I'm just gonna take this guy, this little object, put that there, and we'll. Do it again. And you know what? Just had an idea. Do it again. Put it down. And then just go wacky with it. There we go. Okay. So, I mean, it's not, in, it's not insanely detailed. But we've got... We've got the main streets covered, you know, the basic parts of it. Like I said, you know, we'll continue building on the detail of everything. So we'll continue that in another video. But um, I think that's going to be it for this one. Um, you guys take care now. See you.